Review. The fantastic move from sports to business. In the kind of world we live in today, people want to focus on one field of life. No one wants to move or swap from a line or industry they have become comfortable in with another. And even when they do make that change, not many people are successful at it. This has discouraged people from even having the thought. But that really isn't what happens to everybody. It is possible to make that switch and surpass the affluence and influence your previous field got you. And we see an example from the life of one of the wealthiest men in Uganda, Karim Herji. Welcome to Motivation Army, a channel whose focus is on top names and motivational excerpts from their words and lifestyle. Today's focus is on Karim Herji. Who is Karim Herji? The name Karim Herji unsurprisingly did not begin in this decade. Haram Herji once used to be a name popular in the field. He was once an automobile race driver. And it is important that we add here that he was a well-respected race driver not just by words, but by achievements that were predominant through the 1960s and 1970s. But the change began during the late 1980s to the early 1990s when he decided it was time to branch out from being the usual automobile race driver champion. To do this, he decided to dabble in trading in textiles and alcoholic beverages from a shop on Luwam Street in central Kampala. The unprecedented switch from sports car racing to trading gives us the first important lesson we learn from Kareem Herji. It is never too late to make that switch. No one would have expected that a former champion would excel far from the world of sports. It is not enough to follow the norm. Why didn't he become a coach? Or find another job in the sports industry when he was done taking the wheels of the car? But Kareem Herji is different. He knew what he wanted, didn't want to follow the pattern, and made sure he made a name for himself outside the sporting industry. This is what others would have done. So, what did he do? Kareem Herji in the limelight. Don't be afraid to start small. Nothing great starts big, and even the lives of more popular wealthy men and business gurus sell this same truth. Things take time. Don't be scared or tempted to give up when the sky gets cloudy. Kareem Herji knew this for truth, which explains why he stuck to his vision even when it was all a dream. The dream of becoming a successful businessman kicked off when he founded his first company, a company that went by the name Dem Enterprises. While Dem Enterprises was not much to begin with, it grew and developed into what is known today as the Dem Group of Companies. The whole company features the media's involvement, the Dem radio station, an automobile dealership, an amusement park, a finance and insurance business, and a chain of hotels under the Imperial Group. How well did the switch work for Kareem Herji? Today, the Uganda businessman is said to command respect in most industries that shape the Ugandan economy. This started with him making that switch to a profession. It started with deciding not to be limited, from seeing a clear vision and putting in the effort to make that dream a reality. Kareem Herji is estimated to be valued at 800 million US dollars today, and this would have been an unattainable feat had he remained in the automobile racing industry. He became the Uganda business conglomerate owning the former Uganda Commercial Bank, which he renamed Cham Towers, from being a sports racing champion. When you see a need to switch, don't let the fear of the unknown hold you back. Be ready to make that big move. That's all for today's video. Let me know your thoughts in our comment section. Like. Share. And subscribe.